YouTube, it's been a while. Just heading out today, thought I'd share it with you guys. I know I haven't made a video in quite some time, so I thought, bugger it, I've got a spare day, gonna head up to Yarra Junction and have a look. Um, so I thought, who better to take me with than you guys? Alrighty, let's go. Speed humpy, one would say. Bags of firewood over there, private property. It looks like they're 15 bucks each. Dogs on leads only. And I believe it closes at 5.30 every night. But if you book, you get a code to the gate. So, there you go. Something over here. I don't know if you can see that. It's a toilet block, rotunda. Water wheel. More picnic areas. Kids play equipment down there now. That's cool. Bring the young ones up as well. Down here we've got some toilet shower block. I don't think the showers work anymore. For some reason I remember coming here a few years back and the showers were no longer uh, working. The wreck hall just there. I wonder if you can still get in there, let's have a look. Fun fact about this wreck hall, when I was a kid uh, we lived in Upper Yarra and there was a big bushfire, uh, Ash Wednesday, I think it was called. And we actually had to bunker down in this shed. Well, I don't remember it, but apparently that's what happened. Uh, and it's all blocked off. Bugger, you used to be able to get in there and they had like ice machine and um, camper beds and that sort of stuff, but who knows? Probably bloody vandalism again or something. Have a look around the other side. Yep, she's all boarded up now. So no access there. So this is another bit of the campground. So, best in best dressed, I think this one is. And I don't know how much is it a night. I think it was about 20 bucks a night or something from memory. And down on those tree lines is the river. So there's a big river down there. Comes fresh out of the uh, Upper Yarra Dam. So it's quite friggin' cold, but awesome in summer. Um, yeah, check this out. I'll have to do a rig run down one day. New lights at the top, got rid of the big roof rack up there and uh, installed some uh, spotlights. Pretty impressive. All right, let's move.
so here we are this is the uh, bridge um, and you can come down and have a swim well not really a swim but it's pretty cool let's have a look So the water is pretty murky at the moment, not sure why. It's usually crystal clear um, with a few sort of rock pools and stuff down there. It is running pretty high at the moment. Um, I don't know, maybe they're doing some work up the upstream or something, creating a bit of muddy in the water, but who knows. But yeah, through summer, it's usually running a bit slower. Um, and yeah, usually crystal clear to the point where you could pretty much just drink it straight out of the river. Uh, so yeah, I might jump on the old internet and find out what's going on there. But yeah, had a look in the toilets. There's definitely no showers in there anymore. Um, there was showers in there at some point, but yeah, it looks like they've all been removed. Uh, but you know, as far as dunnies go, it was pretty clean, I guess. Oh, uh, let's keep looking. So it looks like they've really upgraded this place because last time I was here a few years back, none of this was here. Um, so you've got tennis, basketball courts, um, a bit of a shelter there. Huge as uh, playing oval down the back there. I don't think you're allowed to camp on that, so that's gonna stay um, not so muddy. Toilets there. And yeah, all this new playground. Barbecues down there. We'll definitely be returning in summer uh, with the kids because, yeah, that's pretty awesome. Um, good work up at Yarra Dam, people. <laughs> Alrighty, so that was up at Yarra Dam. Um, yeah, pretty awesome. Definitely going to come back uh, through summer. So last time I was here, none of this was here. It's, um, yeah, it was obviously closed up for a reason for I think a couple of years or a year or so, maybe a year and a half. Um, so yeah, I might head over to uh, Marysville now, see if I can get through a lot of the roads that closed because of snow and stuff like that. So see how we go.